Hi Aries, welcome to my channel. This is a next 24 hour star reading session for you Aries. I hope you are well. I hope you are fine and safe and doing good Aries. This reading for today Aries, this is your next 24 hours reading. Let us see what's coming towards you. Okay. What is the message for Aries in love, relationship, dating, getting to know? What is the message for Aries in, in career, finance, and general situationship, okay? This is your urgent message. What is your next 24 hours reading? What can I get for Aries, please? Before I start, guys, I would really like to thank you for coming here. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. Guest viewers, if you haven't clicked the bell, click the bell now and click subscribe. And if you would like to further connect with me, Aries, I invite you to also be part of our mailing list. And we have a new channel. We will be putting videos there very soon in the new moon. So if you want to connect with me on a daily basis, uh, please be part of the channel. All of you know the details on how to connect with me uh, to support the, the channel and the merchandise, you know, um, it's down the description box below, okay? So let's see what's coming towards you. What is the next 24 hours reading for you? What can I get for Aries, please? Okay. Wow, you've got the Ace of Cups. Okay. It seems to be there is new love coming your way in a form of a apology. Okay. Uh, for some of you, it, it feels like it's someone in the past that you know. And it feels like this the Ace of Cups, I feel like it's new love or it feels brand new, but it's coming from the past, okay? It could be a missed opportunity and this person or this situation that you're about to have or to activate it this weekend onwards, um, there was a missed opportunity between the two of you. It's more of a, there was like a missed opportunity or a misunderstanding and you did not fight for it they did not fight for it you both i guess you you both decided to call it quits you know so it it is a new beginning it it feels like a new beginning but it's a person or it's it's, it's a person or a situation in the it's a person or a situation in the past and you've never really gotten to know this person or situation so it's returning to you okay so it could be ace of cups it could also represent um support you know like a maybe you were not you're supposed to work with someone you know in a it's emotional support or romantic support romantic relationship as well but it's a one-on-one -on -one relationship okay six of swords now the person, the situation connecting to you, they wish that you would, um, like that you would accept their apology, you would accept the missed opportunity. They really want to bring lots of new ideas, if this is business or at work or maybe at home. If this is romantic, they really want to treat your connection like a brand new connection. And Six of Swords, you know, you guys move on from the past and you guys you know build you know a strong foundation again with each other it feels brand new but it feels like it's coming from the past like a missed opportunity king of wands yeah this person this situation aries um there was a lot of pride i think you're also there's ego on you and there's also pride but this person feels like you know it's we like you know we need to like it's just so sad if we will not give our you know connection a second chance you know ace of cups king of wands and they're coming to me aries very determined and very excited with the idea that you would work together or maybe you're going to live together, work together, business par partner together, travel together, or you'll be together like a partner again, or maybe you will date again. But their, their expectation is to start all over again. And there's no pointing fingers in that. Let's not look 
let's let's not look at the past and let's just move forward in King of Wands and be excited on how have you been, how your life has been, and how my talent, my skills, my love would merge into your present situation. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles. Wow. You know, Aries, this person is a game changer. Like, if it's not going to happen soon, I feel like this um, offer, this relationship, this connection, I feel like it's going to happen when you're so bored. <laughs> like, it will appear to you when you're kind of bored. I'm really getting like, you're so bored. You're bored. And out of nowhere, this person texted you, emailed you called you and it was just the right timing and you know you would and suddenly a rush of excitement is there you know thinking of oh I'm gonna work with to them again I'm gonna be with them again I'm gonna date with them again so I feel like it would come into your life when things are more like this offer this person this situation it will come to you when things are more I'd say moderate you know because I feel like for some of you guys, you know, the universe would like to clear up, would like to clear some of your, you know, the universe would like to assist you or help you clear some of your challenges. So you have a space to accommodate this and you are, you will, you are able to manage this situation that will come through to you. Okay. So yeah, I feel like not so long not not very long aries this would um this you would Im eventually start this this new cycle okay now the next reading you have six of wands for some of you guys there's something there's something about online there's something about there's something about the there's something about the social media, the public, the internet, the advertisement that would assist you to look what you have been looking for. Um, it could be job. It could be Ten of Swords closure. You know, for some of you, you could be looking for a closure or you could be looking for an answer. But there's something online that you would, yeah, the justice card. For some of you, you're looking for closure and you're researching 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 investigating 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 and boom it's in front of you it's in their social media account it's online it's headline it's somewhere out there in the public or maybe if you keep researching you keep digging if you ask directly the person or the friend of yours that knows it would be publicly like it would be it you would get it so six of wands ten of swords you would be able to have a closure or move on or you get to know a very important information that will allow you to close off the cycle okay let me just move this a little bit yeah so you would be able to move on quickly when you see this news or information or someone tells you this okay i'm picking up in general maybe you were looking for a job and then you're wondering what happened to my application and then boom you saw online that we regretfully blah 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 or maybe you're kind of thinking why did this person stop replying responding and then you realize that oh they've been posting a lot of photos online and then they, they could not respond to you so it's kind of no response is there actually a response but there's a it it will get you you will your intuition will tell you like whoa this is this is what I've been looking for. I feel like it's this weekend. Like you're out and about. It, you did not expect that you would browse, you would see it, or you would get it in a quiet moment. I'm really getting like, you know, in your quiet moment, you get the answer or a closure. Yeah, seven of swords. And as soon as you get the answer or the details, you run away. <laughs> seven of swords. Okay, exit. Okay, this is the closure, this is the answer, now it's time to exit. You'll suddenly drop, you know, something, eject, eject button, you know, so, yeah. Mm. Could be an X, but there's a little bit of spying and exploring and really wanting to know the answer and boom, you got the answer and so quickly 
you turn your back away like you maneuver away from that because of what you see so i think it's happened for some of you but i think for some of you it's it's about to happen now the last reading you have the chariot card you could be dealing with cancer Ooh, king of cups this is mr romantic or miss romantic so for some of you um this will happen very fast okay um you've been really wanting this person to open up their feelings to you or to be emotionally connected to you you are so keen to know what they feel towards you the chariot card the king of cups you will have that moment you will have a window you will have a window of opportunity aries next month to have like a one-on-one -on -one or this person to express their feelings to you like someone is gonna go and be vulnerable and really connect to you emotionally and it's like a tell all like you get to to get to ask them any questions and they will be very honest to tell you uh, everything they feel about you everything they what 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 they feel what they think it's like a tell all situation an opportunity we know opportunity uh, to tell all something and it's romantic and it's love okay lover's card i see see look at that i told you guys oops sorry <laughs> sorry guys so yeah the king of cups the lover's card you know maybe someone is going to tell you that i'm falling in love with you or maybe someone is going to tell you that but there's going to be a heart-to-heart -heart conversation that will happen if not the end of this month pretty much soon soon i'm really getting like it's yeah it's very soon very soon aries you get to connect emotionally with someone okay let's see okay very emotional this is a king and then the lover's card i feel like it's your soulmate let's see okay this card one yeah four of cups now um okay this card wanted to come out yeah so i feel like there's a part of you that you have outgrown or made like this is this is subject to your approval let's put it that way so there, there's gonna be an open like a heart-to-heart -heart conversation that will happen uh between you and a person and it's romantic and I feel like you will have the chance to say yes or to say no but they are going to be very vulnerable they are going to tell you what they really feel feel towards you they're really gonna express with no filter like no filter um, opening up with you Aries so I feel like you know you don't need to say yes or to say no right away because I feel like um this is something that if you sign up for this it could take you know it like if if you sign up for this it it it's it sorry <laughs> noise <laughs> we're in mercury retrograde if you sign up for this it could be long term it could be an ex who disappointed you and you're kind of wondering whether they're they're, they're being real um you for some of you it's a mixed message that i'm getting for some of you don't say yes right away for some of you you might say yes so i with this reading with the last reading i really want you aries to follow your intuition because it will it will really guide you to how you're going to deal with this person one thing about this person is that um they're quite because you with the four of cups the full card like there's a there's a rush you know the chariot card like there's a rush coming for me do i need to say yes do i need to say no but you don't need to rush but they are quite in a rush so you can really tell this person that we should take time and you should if you need to but there's so much love in here and catching up so this is what i have for you aries thank you so much for your support and for being here i will see you soon again guys you have a great day